Blake, how you doing? I'm doing well. It's, it's always good to get a W. Oh, it's fantastic. Greg Rubel, Riley Nelson upstairs. Thanks for coming on. Uh, how much do you note or not note the cold out there when you're in the heat of battle and you're trying to win a football game? It was chilly out there, but are you even feeling it? Uh, I wasn't feeling it until I was sitting on the sideline for a little bit towards the end of the game. When we went to victory formation, I put my helmet on all the way frozen. <laughs> but other than that, it was, it was great. What can you say about the kid? The third-year freshman, Soljay Mayava-Peters, gets his first start as a Cougar and goes all the way in the win tonight. Hey, man, we were excited. We were excited when we heard he was going to be the guy. Um, all week we had really good practices. Um, I think as a team we did a really good job of supporting him and just having full confidence in him and just seeing what he could do. And he came out and balled like we knew he would. Blake, I wasn't part of the preparation, but if I were, I would have put this, you know, I would have challenged you and your four uh, fellow O-linemen up front and put this game on on your backs, at least offensively. Whenever you're breaking in a new quarterback, the getting those guys up front to play well, was that a big part of the game plan coming in to not only you guys play well to keep him clean, but also take pressure off him by opening up holes for him and the other running backs? Yeah, 100%. I think as an offensive line, we knew we had to do our part in uh, protecting the, the young quarterback and just let him do his thing. Um, we kind of knew that we'd have to come out here and control the line of scrimmage just to just to compete against these guys, and we knew they'd score a lot of points, or we knew they could score a lot of points, but our defense came through, and at the, at the end of the day, we ended up with the W. How did you and the team feel about last year's bowl game, and, and did it play at all into maybe some of the, the thoughts of, of what you guys could and should do a year later in the postseason? Um, I think we talked about last year's bowl game um, and emphasized more excitement, more energy. Um, I think we did a poor job last year just coming in real flat and just we weren't the most excited team to play. So I think uh, going on, coming on this bowl trip, we were all excited to have fun with each other, spend some time with each other, and come out and, come out and get a win. Anytime you can run for 200-plus yards, you've got a good shot to win the game. And BYU ran for 209 tonight. Not bad, right? Yes, sir. It's always fun that way. And uh, you end the game, end the season with a big win at Stanford, big ground game, and here as well. Uh, whether it's throwing it a lot or, or running it the when you need to, it's just about the W, right, Blake? Exactly right. Blake, um, just uh, it's been a, a great career for you, and uh, holding down that tackle position that's uh, so immensely difficult. What can you say about this final challenge that SMU presented in the 2022 season? Uh, they had a just a lot of respect to their defense. They had a lot of good D linemen. They had a lot of a lot of things they threw at us that were uh, difficult, but um, at the end of the day, it was just just a good, fun game. Um, just great to go out on this bowl game with a dub. Have you already decided uh, that this is it for you, Blake? Have you already talked about that or not talked about that? I know you have eligibility left, but is this it? Um, I think I'll, I'll make that decision next week. Okay, so the, that, that, that decision's coming for you. You haven't said anything yet then, right? Yeah. Okay, I wasn't trying to put you on the spot. I really hadn't known if you'd said anything or not. So you'll, you'll make a decision soon. Yes, sir. All right, well, if this is the last game you played, it's been a pleasure to call your games, and uh, thank you for your, the time you played and for what you put out there, and uh, we'll see what's to come. Best of luck with whatever you set, decide. Yes, sir. I appreciate you. All right, thank you, Blake. That's Blake Freeland.